Shield encryption is a Salesforce product that you can buy and it basically encrypts your data. Let's dive a little bit deeper. So you have Salesforce, which is running on top of a database that's shared with all Salesforce customers. And here is your data record. You can use Salesforce's classic encryption and using that, you can encrypt this information. In that scenario, the encryption key is with Salesforce. Salesforce maintains that encryption. However, certain customers of Salesforce need to maintain their own key. They may have a legal compliance regulatory or some other contractual requirement. That is when you buy this puppy. What Shield Encryption does is it gives you the ability to have your own key. This could be a software key. You could also use a hardware security module or an HSM based key. And that way you are encrypting this data with your own key. The typical risk that you're addressing with this is that in the highly unlikely event that someone can actually get to that, that physical disk on which this record is stored, or if some internal database user gets to this record through some unauthorized means, that's the risk that you're covering. For a lot of businesses, that's still a risk that they are obligated to comply with based on their perception of risk based on their compliance, legal, regulatory requirements, whatever the case is. Shield encryption is quite a popular choice with customers. There is a very high need to have full control on the kind of encryption you're doing. What shield encryption is not is that if someone had access to your Salesforce instance, whether in production or in sandboxes, they will actually just go in through the regular route and they will be able to see this information. The second part is shield encryption also encrypts your files and attachments. So if you have files attached to your data, those will be encrypted by shield. 